Hi, and welcome. I'm JC. You're probably here because you have a funeral or a memorial service to attend, and that probably means you've lost somebody close to you, so I'm really sorry to hear that. And uh, I hope what we go through today will make it quick and easy for you to choose what to wear to the service. Remember that the overall goal is to support the family in their grief. That's why you're attending a service. So the event isn't about you, and so don't draw attention to yourself. Good rule of thumb. Nobody should remember what you were wearing. As you choose what to wear, as a great kind of guideline, just go with quiet, subtle, understated, modest, dark, conservative, and somber types of clothing. Head to toe black, it's always safe, but it doesn't have to be only black. Um, if it's not black, then stick with chocolate browns, navy blues, dark greens, and maybe even a camel or a tan, something neutral. Stick with dark colors when you can, and if you do wear a pattern, wear something that's very subtle and quiet. So maybe a small-scale plaid or a pinstripe or a small-scale polka dot might work. It's disrespectful to be casually dressed at a funeral, so no shorts or jeans, yoga pants, mini skirts, flip-flops, sneakers, t-shirts, crop tops, tube tops, sports jerseys, or track suits, unless the family tells you otherwise. You're going to be avoiding bold logos, anything strapless, any loud animal prints, any sequins, bodycon dresses, bright colors, or anything else that's going to draw attention to you. Remember, the goal is to have no attention brought to you. This is about the decedent, not about you. So don't wear all white. White in Western culture is reserved for brides um, at weddings, and it shouldn't be worn to a funeral. No bare shoulders and nothing too revealing, so choose modest clothing. Stick to low-key, subtle, and understated jewelry if you choose to wear jewelry at all. This is not the time for all of your bling. In addition to those basic guidelines, just consider the weather, especially if it's a graveside burial. Because if there's any chance of inclement weather, you're going to need to be prepared for that. So bring a black umbrella, a dark dress coat, a trench coat maybe dark gloves. You should be in sensible shoes you can walk in. You may have to walk all the way across um, a graveyard and in, in muddy or wet conditions. So a classic boot, a wedge, maybe short pumps, lace-up dress shoes, those would be appropriate. Also, when considering the location, dress appropriately for it, meaning if the memorial service is in any kind of a religious setting or house of worship, then dress quite conservatively. You're going to need to wear skirts that are you know, usually knee length or longer. You're going to cover your arms and your shoulders. You're going to wear closed toed shoes. If it's a celebration where ashes are being spread, then it may be outdoors. And again, if that's the case, then it might be more casual, but you should still dress in somber sorts of ways. Um, so khakis and a, and a sweater, for example, might be appropriate if the ashes are being spread um, outside in a park, um, but that wouldn't be appropriate if you were inside a, uh, a house of worship. If the person who's passed is a member of the military, then guests who are also members of the armed forces should wear their formal dress uniforms. So those are called Class A uniforms usually, and if you're part of the military, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Same goes for funerals of law enforcement, police officers, firefighters. Wearing your full dress uniform is expected, and if you're not in uniform, then wear a dark formal suit or a you know, full coverage black dress or something that will blend in with the uh, dress uniforms of all of the rest of the service members. All of these guidelines are based on Western culture, so of course if you're part of another culture, these may not apply to you. There are times when a family might ask attendees to wear a particular color or to wear, for example, a sports jersey or in some way honor what the uh, deceased wanted. So if they ask you to wear something specific, then please do that. Honor their wishes. Again, I'm sorry for your loss and I hope that these ideas help you choose something appropriate to wear to the upcoming funeral or memorial. Please take good care. Bye.